Day number 30. We made it. We've been fishing every single day this month. I have to be at work at five, right now it is 3.57, so I'm gonna have 30 minutes to fish today at the Washington Sailing Marina again. Um, I wish I didn't have to be so crunched for time today, but it is what it is. And I'm fishing a tournament tomorrow on Lake Barcroft, so I'm gonna throw that video into this one as well, but I wanna show you guys that I am fishing every single day. And this is by far the shortest amount of time that I've fished. I think before this it's been two hours. So let's get out here and try to catch some fish before work. We'll see what happens. All right, guys, so here we go. Starting off with a Texas rig speed crawl. I'm gonna throw it around these posts a bit along this bank, and I'm gonna move down the docks if I can, if I have time. Where are you? After I caught that muskie yesterday, I couldn't even speak English for the first hour afterwards. Everything that was coming out was just blabbering nonsense. I couldn't even form a sentence. And that had nothing to do with the sleep deprivation. It was all the musky. Oh, it's a bite. Oh, oh, eat it. Come on. Something just ate it. He's got it again. Oh, it's something small. Oh my God. He's got it again. Last cast. Gotta go to work. I still got out and fished. And we have the tournament tomorrow, so. Oh yeah. <laughs> day number 30, actually day number 31, but we're gonna roll these two together. Jay and I are fishing a tournament here on Lake Barcroft. I'm pretty tired. We're at the end of this 30 day challenge. I'm, yeah, I finally hit the wall. Last time, Jay won big fish, so props for that. Five and a half pounder? Yes, sir. And his PB at the time, which he broke like a week later with the six pounder. Six and a half? That's true. Sicko, so let's get out here and catch some fish, guys. Yeah. It's the launch. No, I'm starting off with the frog. Are you really? Oh, he threw it. Dang. Try a Texas rig. Here you go. Jay is just on a roll. Time to get the skunk off. There we go. Oh yeah, it's a good one. Oh yeah, it's a good, solid. Oh, 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 there we go. That's huge. <laughs> it's decent. It's like a four. I'm gonna get a quick weight on this fish. 3.94. Solid. It's a good start. Alright, see you, buddy. First fish was caught on that weightless Senko. First cast. This is called the South Africa Special. It's a limited edition. Good luck finding this one. Just kidding. <laughs> so this is a five inch Senko I cut off, I don't know, inch and a half of it. Make it about that size. Throw it on there, weightless Texas rigged. We're good to go. Let's go catch another four pounder. Got him? Small. Open it. Oh! Oh, Ooh, I spooked something up there. Oh, he's got it. Nice. Oh yeah, fish number two. 1.85, keeper number two. See you later, pretty. All right, I'm gonna stick to throwing this Senko until I get a limit, then I might try something a little bit bigger. Fish. Big one. Nah, that's not big. No, nah, it's decent though. <clears throat> oh yeah, keeper number three. 1.69. See ya. Thank you. Gonna retie this bad boy real quick. 
telling you guys, it is all about the South Africa special. That's a fish. Oh, sh oh. the big one? Nah, I just fell. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Man, that would have helped. It's a fish. Dang, that would have been back to back. 1.16. Got him. Oh yeah. Let's go. Not bad, not bad. It's the limit fish. Yeah, it's number five. This one's gonna go 1.45. We have a total weight of 10.1 pounds. So we have to get rid of the 1.16 pound fish. We gotta call that bad boy. There. Yeah. Just looks fancy. Oh, that's a fish. That's a decent one too. All right. He should call. I'm gonna show you how to unhook a gut hooked fish. So first you want to get your plastic out of the way. Keep them in the water too if you can. So you want to cut your line outside the mouth. You're going to go on the outside of the gill plate. What I do is I push the line down so I can grab it. Just kind of fish it through. So you really just want to be careful of their gills here. Actually, you know what? That one's going to have to go through the other side. So you're going to want to fish it through this way. All right, so you want the hook coming out their gill plate like that. Get it straight up, and then it pops right out. There you go. No blood on the fish. He's good to go, he's lively. Gonna get a quick weight on him and release him. Got him? Yeah. Need a net? No. Sure? Maybe. Ah. Here, bring him this, slow down. Oh. Where'd he go? It was out. Oh, dude, I'm one. so sorry. Oh, that's good. Oh, no, no. Ah, you dog. You got him back? Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, he had the gripper in his mouth. I didn't want him to swim away with it. 1.80. This is the liveliest fish I've ever had to deal with. This little crazy guy. See ya. Fishy. He will not call. Got him. Oh. oh, it was a dink. <laughs> I thought it came up. They're hitting it on the fall, honestly. Yeah, I do. If you watch your line, you can see it jump. That like 90% of the fish I've caught today, I've been like, oh, there's a fish before I've even reeled down to it. All right, well, now that we got a little wind, I guess I can try a chatterbait for a few casts, and then I'm gonna go back to the Senko, and then from there, I'm gonna go with the jig. I don't know, I just wanna catch another fish. Last cast. All right. Going to weigh in. Well, well, well. Jay? Ah! As far as weights go, I weighed in 10.78 pounds, which was probably, I don't third know, or third or fourth. I came in second for big fish, so I had a big fish of 3.94 pounds, and Tim had a big fish of 3.95 pounds. <laughs> so congrats on that, that's pretty sweet. Um, we're gonna fish our way back to the ramp, then I'm gonna go home and edit this video, this final video of the 30 day challenge, and I'm gonna talk to you guys a little bit more about it. See if we catch any more fish. 4.25. Nice. Well, there you have it. I didn't even have time to put the GoPro on. And Jay wax a 4.25 pound stud on the Kitek. So funny. That would have been big fish of the day. Yeah, it would have. <laughs> it's up to you. I don't care. I'm pretty tired, man. I'm like dead. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh. That was crazy. <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> yeah, that was wild. Nah, I, feel you, I kind of want to throw the frog now. You know what? I am going to try the frog a little bit. We're going to see if we can get on that midday frog bite since that one just blew up on my Senko. I mean, if that one hit the Senko on top, one should hit this freaking frog. Yeah. Something something tells me we're gonna get one on this frog, dude. Oh, 
Got him. Oh yes, midday top water bite. That was sick. That woke me right up. Thanks, buddy. Mm, got him. It's not bad. Hell yeah. Come here, buddy. Oh, that was sick. I love this frog bite, man. That was awesome. What a stud. Look how fat he is. A little chunk. That was awesome. God, that was cool. They're not even really smoking it. They're just sucking it down. Hell yeah. Beautiful fish. Really awesome way to end off this 30 days. Wrecked my frog. Damn, that was awesome, dude. I, I like never fish topwater in the middle of the day, so. But I I've always heard that it works. I've seen it work. I just never do it. I want one to explode on it. I come up and jump and take it out <sighs> of the water. Like I have to wait for him to hit the water before I can set the hook. Oh, oh, dude. Oh my oh, God, man. I saw that come up. That was so oh, sick. Oh no. I saw his shadow behind the frog. I was like, oh my God, he's coming. Oh, I got one coming for it. Oh. <laughs> God, this is awesome. I could see him coming from the left. I was like, oh, he's coming for it. He's looking at it. He came right off of that stump. Even though it's little fish, this is so cool. Oh yeah, that's like what, the third third frog fish? In the matter of 20 minutes? Eating, baby, eating. We're gonna get a big one doing this, dude. You are, you already did. No, 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 I mean like a pig. One of us will. So the day was supposed to end about an hour ago. We were just gonna fish back to the ramp. And then we just got on this sick topwater bite and we were like, well, let's keep going. This is awesome. So stoked. Been a good day. I mean, I'm exhausted. I need to go home and edit this video. I'm on like two hours of sleep. I'm at the end of the rope here. But these bites are just keeping me awake. It's ridiculous. It's going to be back there. Oh. Looks nice. It's, a, it's okay. It's, it doesn't need the net. That was, you called that? You said it's going to happen back there. Wow. Woo! And now you gotta there we go. On the frog again. Jay called that one in the back of this little pocket. See you later, buddy. Dude, one of us has to run into a giant PMA. Positive musky attitude. Even when we're fishing for bass. The pads. Oh no! Oh no! Sorry, dude. Jesus. Oh, yo, oh, he popped off. I, I don't think they're liking it in this dirty water, though. <clears throat> so we're gonna mess around with this. Oh, no. Is it a fish? I think it is a fish. Oh, oh it yeah. is a fish. Nice. Oh, it's, it's a, a good one. fish. You want it? I'll grab him. He's probably. Looks like a four, dude. Oh, he's gonna have. Yeah, at least. Oh yeah. There we go. Dude, there's another one right there. Seriously? Double up. Double this up. The male. Double you up. The female. Look at that. Sick. Peace out, baby. That fish just stuck there. I set the hook into it, and it was like not moving. Yeah. Back to the Senko because they are just not touching the frog in the dirty water. I'm looking for like a five plus. Did you hear uh, back at the end of the year? Oh, nice. There we go. Yeah, it's a little one. Hey yo. Oh yeah. Alright, we're gonna hit the last spot of the day, I think. Like three times. Yeah, I know, but the fishing's been so good, I just I don't want to stop. Oh, what the heck, I gotta throw the frog up here. Oh, dude, I just had one smoke it. Spot. 
God. That. that looked like a bigger fish, dude. Yeah, dude. Oh, it's, oh, oh, it's a it's giant. Huge. Oh, yeah, he's a toad. That's the one we've been looking for all day. Get him. Oh, it won't even fit, dude. Go tail. There you go. Yeah. Thanks, dude. That's solid. That's the fish we've been looking for all day long right there, my friends. Yes, that's a that's a five. Yeah, Wow, did you see him come out of the water? There we go. Pre-spawn fish. Look how fat it is still. Smoked the frog. That was sick. This is why we've been out here all day. This is probably a five pounder. I'm gonna get a quick weight on it. 504. Yeah, that's a pre-spawn fish, dude. Super shallow. Yeah. Literally, like, in a foot of water. God, it's a giant. That beautiful fish. That was awesome. That's what I've been looking for all day. The top water. <laughs> we oh, can buddy. finally call it a day. <laughs> See you later, big mama. That's the fish we were looking for all day. It only took us 10 hours to do it. <laughs> my fish right where I wanted to catch it. Oh my God. Oh my God, let me get it. Oh, it's another good one, dude. Oh, he's not as big, not nearly as big. I thought he was dude, a, I thought it was another one. Three. Yeah, there we go. Whew. Dude, look, it hit it so hard, there's a wake on the bank. Dude, they are crushing these <laughs> frogs. This is awesome. Look at that. My handle came off. <laughs> Dude, I saw that. Oh, yeah. Look at that. My real handle came off. <laughs> I lost it. God, that was sick. Oh. Another little healthy two pounder. God, that was nuts. This is just like, so exciting. It's like some of the coolest fishing. I want to get it back there. Go ahead. Oh my god! God, these fish are nuts! Smoking them! Smoking them! <laughs> Absolutely annihilating this freaking frog right now. I, like, I don't even know what to say. I'm speechless. Last cast of the 30 day challenge. Time to roll. Oh my God, what an afternoon. It's absurd. Wow. What a finish part to this two. sprinting marathon, part two. Dude, that was insane. That was a crazy day. Perfect way to finish off the 30 day fishing challenge. Actually 31 day, because today's day number 31. Had to do it, got out and fished every day for 31 days straight, filmed, posted a video, edited. Now I get to go home and edit this, so we'll see you there. We're done. I just finished editing yesterday's video, finally. It is 5.53 in the morning on May 1st, and we are done with the 30 day fishing challenge, which turned into the 31 day fishing challenge, which that last day was just, honestly probably one of my favorite days over the course of the last 31. Um, the musky hunt obviously is going to take number one because that was just absurd. It was totally crazy, but bass fishing wise, yesterday was amazing. Jay and I couldn't even get off the water. I was supposed to be home at 1, 1.30, and I didn't get home until 6, and I only lived 10 minutes away from Jay, so that should tell you how good the fishing was. But yeah, I just wanted to take a second to thank you guys for all the support, for watching these videos. And I just wanted to say I hope you enjoy them. I hope you learn something from them. I hope you are entertained. And I also wanted to thank you for being a part of this community. We have a really awesome following. All of you guys are very, very cool. And everyone's super helpful. I mean, I have people send me emails, novels on musky fishing. And it just totally blows my mind, but it's amazing. And I genuinely appreciate it. I mean, half the people I fish with now, I met through YouTube. Half the places that I've fished, I've fished with these people who have access to fish them. 
And then there's things like catching a muskie, which I would have never done if it weren't for you guys. So thank you. I really appreciate it. And yeah, it's awesome. You guys are the best. So over the next two days, I'm going to be taking it pretty easy, catching up on some sleep and probably trying to do a vlog. So the goal here is for you guys to go ahead and comment below with any questions you may have. And I'm going to do kind of an AMA styled vlog where you guys just ask me a bunch of questions. And over the course of the next two days, I'm going to scroll through the comments and answer the questions that, you know, stick out the most to me. So yeah, if you're interested in doing that, go ahead and hit me with any question. It doesn't have to be fishing related. It doesn't have to be 30 day fishing challenge related, but yeah. Let me know if you have any questions, I'll answer them. But for now, I'm gonna go to sleep because I'm exhausted. And I finally get to sleep a little bit. So, see you guys on Wednesday. Good night. <laughs>